Nerd. <laughs> I have it. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So, I've been seeing a lot of people do a fire assumption, ask me assumption, ask me questions. I say, you know what, let me jump on the trend as well. So, I've got Nell in the background and she's going to ask me some questions that you guys have been asking me on Yole. The catch of this video is you can't edit it. So, I'm screwed. Do you know what I mean? Because as much as I do put out a lot on YouTube, I'm a private person. Do you know what I mean? in this video. <laughs> <laughs> I'm a private person. So I don't know how this video is going to turn out. Um, yeah, so I'm just going to start now. You're engaged. <sighs> I'm engaged in the streets, baby. <laughs> um, you struggled to finish your degree. Fact. I quit woeful times, but my mom, everyone was like, you know what, you better get your ass back to you. Mm. So yeah, that's true. You have a tattoo. No, I don't. Let me put this time around, one second. Okay, right, that's fine. Let's start again. <laughs> you have a tattoo. No, I don't have a tattoo. Do. Where's the tattoo? I'll find it. <laughs> I don't have a tattoo, but I have been really admiring all these small mini tattoos, hmm. but I'm not going to get it because I love my life. You love being an engineer. I really do. Even though it does have its challenges because it is a white male industry. Mm. So it is hard to, you know, motivate yourself. But I absolutely love it. You are good with money. Very good with money. I am really good with saving. I'm very good with that. So you got that right, baby girl. You've never dated someone shorter than you. No. <laughs> Off. I haven't. I've never dated someone. I speak a truth. I've never dated someone shorter than me. Not that it's an issue with that, because if I'm attracted to you, I'm attracted to you. But no, I haven't. Because God mm -hmm. loves me. Sorry, just had to interject. People assume that you have a man. Yes. Next question. No. <laughs> it's fun. <laughs> That's yes. People assume that I have a man. Yeah. You are a virgin. Yeah, I don't know what sex is at all. Never seen it, never touched it, never tasted what it. What is a sex? I don't know what a sex is. I'm saving myself till marriage. You have a secret man. I have a secret man? Mm. No, I feel it's like... It's different to having a man. No, 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 no. I feel like everybody knows Jesus. Do you know what I mean? So he's <laughs> That's not the a real secret. man. Do you know what I mean? That's the oh. only man in my life that you should know. Yeah. Period. Do you ever approach guys first? I call it strategic positioning. Do you know what I mean? If there was a guy that I was feeling, do you know what I mean? I would drop a few bars here and they're like, yo, why are you looking cute today? Huh? I see the beard shining. Do you know? You gotta drop some bars because if you now wait and wait for all the people that you don't like to move to, mm. then that's what you're setting them for. Do you know what I mean? So strategically position mm. yourself. Someone assumed that you are not open about your emotions wow that's a deep question open about my emotions i mean 80 percent of the time i'm actually happy mm. honestly to god 80 percent of the time it's i'm true. actually happy the other 20 percent i mean oh. with me it's like i feel emotions political crank of the higgy haga political how <laughs> i feel like i'm the kind of person that feels emotion strongly. So if I'm happy, mm. I'm really happy. If I'm sad, I'm really sad. Yeah. So I don't know, I don't really like talking about sad times because it's hella depressing, you know, yeah. and I'm over it the next day. Someone said your relationship with God was a hard journey. Um I would say it's a really good journey now. <laughs> and I don't think I think it's like a continuous journey. Mm, You're always true. growing. Mm -hmm. I don't think you will ever reach your peak. Mm you get so i feel like i'm still learning every single day you know sometimes it goes down sometimes it goes up it's a mm. roller coaster but hopefully up is the end of the nation yeah someone said you like nigerian men only only no mm. i don't discriminate that's the thing yeah because i'm a freshie people will discriminate think. Mm. because i'm a freshie <laughs> because i'm a freshie people will think that only like nigerian men but mm. no if, if I feel your vibe, I feel your vibe. Mm. Yeah. Someone said you used to bully people in school. 
what's the definition of bully to you get like what you used to tease the people then I'll say more so in primary school. It doesn't matter. Okay, not in high school. No, I don't think I bullied anyone. I mean, it depends on the definition of bully. I feel like I was, I'm very straightforward, so I may say stuff that nobody asked me to say. Mm. <laughs> um, there's plenty, don't worry, I'll just didn't say them in this. Okay. Somebody assumed that you got all A's and B's in A level because of your degree, obviously. <laughs> Did you? <laughs> <laughs> I failed my first year of A levels. Really? Yeah. I got oh, D's and E's. Mm -mm. Yeah. And then it got kicked out. It was A levels the worst years of my life. I would never do A levels again. I hated it. Yeah. So traumatic. Every time I think about it, oh. wow, I wanna cry. Yeah, That's it's mad. bad. No, so I didn't get A's and B's. No, no, I didn't. That's so mad. Um, someone said you dislike having your natural hair out and having it like long and maintaining it and stuff. I just feel like I just haven't got the style mm. that I want. I feel like I like going bold, but it's hard to maintain a shape up. To I've get... been begging her to go bold. <laughs> Guys, I can't make this up. I can't make this up. I've been begging. I've never begged someone to shave their heads so much in my life. I mean, I like to be bold, but it's yeah. just hard to maintain, especially if I yeah. dye it. So it's not that I don't like my natural hair. I'm so comfortable with myself, but it's just long. I don't like stress in my life, you know? Mm. saying says you have a tattoo. I don't have a tattoo. You do like it though. I do look like I would have yeah. one because I have piercings, but no, I don't have a tattoo. My mom would kill me. Someone says, even though you have a lot of friends, you still feel lonely. No, I don't feel lonely. I have a lot of friends and I feel like I'm so blessed in that aspect that God really actually bust me in terms of mm. friendship. Like, I love my friends. I know that if I'm feeling down, I could call someone and they'll cheer me up. So no, I don't feel lonely at all. Someone said you are really good with money. Yeah, the artist already, Nella. She's waved as well. <laughs> someone said you was a good child at school. I, I was, um... I, I, I was uh, uh, <laughs> I was loud, no, but I don't think that takes bad. away from my goodness. Do you know what I mean? So yeah, I was a good child in high school. Yeah. yeah. Someone asked, "You've had a boyfriend in the last year." That's an interesting assumption. Yes, it is. Next question. No, that's an interesting. That's an I said those that are interest <laughs> need to be interested. <laughs> That's an interesting question. Next question. <laughs> um. Uh. One second. You can sing. That's an assumption. Uh, baby girl, I can sing. Do I sing for you? What song should I sing? Sing for me. I sing don't for know me. the lyrics. Only sing for me. I don't know. Dad, I can actually sing. Um. I can sing. Trust me. Amazing <clears throat> grace. How sweet the sound that saved a wretch like me. Somebody said you have five figures in your account and you're really collecting the engineering money. What's five figures? Five figures over 10k. Mad, mad, mad. No, 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 she has. My love for her own video that she has five figures. I said, send me a tenner. That's what I'm asking for. This is about you. This is about you. <laughs> hmm, that's the interesting assumption. Yes, one. And that's the answer. <laughs> <laughs> um, obviously, you love being an engineer. I love it. Yeah? Yeah. Um, you're into girls. I do love girls. She is. She is. No, I think it's. I can appreciate female okay. beauty. Like I love girls are so beautiful. So I really do appreciate mm. the female body. Mm, right. Someone said you're not a virgin. That's very interesting. That's a very interesting assumption. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. Ask your father that question. Okay? Okay. Okay. Are you gonna ask? <laughs> You were roasted by boys in secondary school because they didn't like you. Facts! No! Niggas 
will call me Shadow Darth Vader. Yes, yes, yes. I was clapped. I was, was clapped bad, yeah. in school. To get, I was really clapped in school. So I mean, doesn't excuse the comments but no nobody toasted me in school nobody was moving to me nobody was checking for me you know and the alarm went off so that's the end of the assumptions that wasn't too bad actually like that wasn't too bad but yeah thank you guys so much for watching and um yeah i'll see you in the next one bye